So let's talk about this last uh, little screenshot that you put red boxes on, and then we'll take a break. Um, yeah. Anything just, you want to add to this, Chris? Yeah, I mean, just just taking it into a meta level at this point. Um, <sighs> not the not the failing company, but more of the actual term meta. Um, wow. wow. The the, um, the fact that you can name your tags, you can combine tags because so, I see a lot of people that have you know have multiple tags on their site you know like they'll have sure. a, and they'll, they'll they'll hire an a uh, an agency and the agency's like well we're gonna we're gonna get our own Google Analytics you know on your site and then they have the the original people have their own analytics on the site so now you can combine these tags you can add destinations you can share users all within Google Ads. That's the main thing that I want to to talk about here is the fact that you can do all of this right from within Google Ads. I, that's the exciting part to me. Not not you, we, I. That's what you really are excited about. You can do all this inside your Google Ads accounts, Chris. I yes. think that's what has you jazzed up about this. Because you don't I have, have to, to deal, rely. Yeah, you on... don't have to deal with developers. You don't have to deal with emails going back and forth yeah. for days and days and days. Now, are you talking about combining Google tags where you pull up the Chrome tag assistant, the uh, Google tag assistant, uh, it says legacy now, so I don't know if there's a new one, but in Chrome, you can add this extension and it'll tell you how many pieces of Google tag are on the website. And then you see like five analytics, yeah, uh, 17 <laughs> yeah. global yeah. tags. And you're like, <laughs> what have you been yeah. through? My, yeah. my young client, what have you been through? Like the pain mm -hmm. you must have dealt with. And then you're exactly. always wondering like, wait, if we have all these Google Analytics tags and all these global tags and all these conversions, like, does that mean we're double counting our traffic? Is our conversion data truly accurate? And they interfere. They interfere, interfere with each other. We've seen that in, where you have like 0% bounce rates and that yep. kind of thing. So are yep. you saying you think this combine your Google tags opportunity we're going to have with the Google tag basically means you can clean up tags that are on the site and basically say, don't count them anymore? Yeah, I think so. Or or all call them this one thing. Wow. That's yeah, that's pretty I think pretty awesome. Yeah, and the fact that you can add users and 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 it says expand website coverage. So I think what that means is that you might have a different tag on, you know, a subdomain or, you know, some other part of the site, maybe uh, you know, different types of tags in different places, maybe you're tra tracking different things and the fact that you can combine these into one central location. I think that is wonderful. I like it and uh overall i'm you know i'm happy 